Hello. Let's model this UEFA Champions League soccer ball for finals with that star design. As you can see, we will work a lot with uh, surfaces, surface patch, extrude, revolve. I will start with a sketch on the top plane with a polygon from the origin, the pentagon shape, and um, make that bottom line horizontal, then give it a dimension 40, 44. Make uh, another one of those. Again, origin five. Make those two edges parallel and horizontal, those two. Everything's defined. Take that, convert it to construction geometry. Then start um, drawing our star. Now, um, let's make one more of those pentagons, the big one, again, five-sided, with the top here, something, and a circle with that diameter. And let's draw one continuous line from that edge to over here. And one from here to that corner. Continue drawing. Here we get that midpoint relationship and that line and this one which is perpendicular to that one okay so um, let's make an equal length relationship between those two edges and the sketch is fully defined, right? We can finish the sketch and go to the surface tab and make an extrude of that circle going down and let's keep that sketch visible and make a revolve of um, that edge around that axis do that one more time with that edge over here that edge around that axis there. Now let's trim with that as the tool. Those two, okay. And hide that body. 
and now create a plane with uh, three points that one and that one and that one except that hide those bodies here and now so let's start a sketch on that plane with a pentagon give that that horizontal constraint make one more here make those parallel and a coincident relationship that point and that one and um, here again horizontal okay and an equal relationship between sketches and fully defined make that construction geometry and let's draw one more time here our um, star Okay, finish that sketch. And now we can define the center of our soccer ball. We will draw a line going down here, normal to that plane, and another one over there. So, start a sketch. Um, a 3D sketch. Going down here, all right and connecting over there to look at that and um, constrain that perpendicular constraint over there now let's define a plane by three points that one that one and that one start a sketch on that plane a circle Diameter 222. A line here. Make that coincident with the origin. And horizontal. Okay, let's break that here. And turn that into construction geometry those two and finish that go into the revolve take that profile around that axis and I'll make that a symmetric I'm gonna make it like that so you can see what we what we'll do next we can look inside Okay, and now we will start the next sketch. And that will be the project to surface command. We take that as the face and now pick those um, stars, those edges. We got the first one, next one, all 
right, let's have a look from outside. Finish the sketch. Delete that surface with a keyboard delete key. I'll hide those other sketches for a moment. So that is what we got, right? Now let's make a, a patch. Number one, keep that sketch visible and patch that one. All right, now let's go to the, to make that a solid with the thicken command. Take that face, go outside, maybe four millimeters. Do that again. Four millimeters, okay. Give that a nice fillet, three millimeters. Again. All right, so we got that. We can hide that sketch with those. Uh, with that definition, and maybe we want to go into the um, appearances tab, and let's have a look at um, some nice um, appearance. I'll take that leather blue, apply that here. Close that, and now let's um, take that sketch here and make a circular pattern of that body around that axis five times, all right? And now we can define that other body we need for uh, this shape here. From that solid geometry, we can define our patch. Take that edge, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Great. And Again, thicken that four millimeters, fill up that three millimeters. Again, some, yeah, leather white. Looks great. Close that and again, make that a um, uh, circular pattern. Five times. Okay. And now we got almost half of that ball. So let's mirror the thing. We will make a path, uh, a plane, a long path. Along. That's the path. Pull that, it locks into that endpoint. Mirror, all we get over that plane, make that a new body, okay. And now we got to rotate things. I'll take the, the upper half and axis is again that one. 36 degrees, okay, and well, same technique, let's make a patch, that edge, that one, 
that one, that one, and that one, and now, here, okay, one more time for that other one, one, two, All right, let's thicken those. Outside, minus four. That one, four. Oops, uh, no, no edge. That face, three millimeters. And that one, three millimeters. Again, A. Appearance. And uh, last circular pattern. That one, that one. Axis. That one. Five times. There it is. And so we got our UEFA soccer ball for finals star design. I hope you liked the tutorial.